Good evening and welcome to the first national debate between the two fine, upstanding, well, uh, two guys we found off the street. Who will spar or which is the better team in Saturday's showdown in Austin between Texas and West Virginia? I'm Gardner Selby, tonight's moderator, mediator, and editor of the Austin American Statesman's PolitiFact Texas. We'd like to begin with an opening statement from each columnist, but please, only a few seconds. We're going to start with columnist Golden. Thank you, Gardner. Let me begin by saying this. Texas is clearly the better team. Mac Brown has the Longhorns back to play in like they were playing in 08 and 09. They want to pressure cooker in Stillwater, took care of business, and the boys in Vegas have installed the Longhorns as a seven point favorite. When have they ever been wrong? Excuse me? Have you seen West Virginia play? I mean, you're talking powerhouse there, okay? Your Longhorns struggled against New Mexico. New Whatever. Mexico. First they gave game. up 31 points to Ole Miss. Yeah, Ole Miss. Road game. Not Alabama. Okay. I'll give you this. The Longhorns are pretty good, but are they really better off than they were four years ago? I ask you. I think not. Let's keep it civil, gentlemen. First question. Is Geno Smith, fabulous initials, the best quarterback in college football? Calmless Bowles. Absolutely. I mean, he's been phenomenal. We're talking more touchdowns than interceptions. That's un heard of. Tom Brady couldn't do that. I mean, I think it's, he's wrapped up the Heisman Trophy already and it's barely October. Gardner, do you remember that movie, Mr. Smith Goes to Washington? Don't date yourself. It's, it was a great movie. This Mr. Smith Goes to New York. Book it. He may be going to New York, but he's got to worry about coming to Austin first. I mean, who has he played? James Madison? The Cordon Bleu? Marshall? Listen, Bowles, I know quarterbacks. I saw Vince Young in high school. I covered Vince Young at Texas. Vince Young is a friend of mine. Your quarterback, sir, he's no Vince Young. There you go again. I mean, West Virginia, we're talking legit BCS contender. Whatever. They're, they're going to be in that title Can't game, okay? Anybody. The Mountaineers are going to roll, and they're going to be setting those couches on fire until the cows come home. Trust me. Call this golden. That's it. You're done now. Call this golden. The Texas defense has missed more stops than a bus driver on strike or on the way to lunch. Joseph Randall ran for 199 yards against these lines. 199. Garbage. I ask you, Almost Mr. Two. Golden, where's the beef? The beef is up front, Gardner, and you're going to see it, I promise. Alex Okafor, Jackson Jeffco, they're going to get after Geno Smith. Manny Diaz, he's not going to rush three and drop eight like Baylor did. He's going to bring the house. And guess what? You're not going to see that what you saw last time against Baylor. Max preaching accountability, and I'm not talking about that 47% stuff. I'm not even sure if West Virginia has running backs. Do you even have running back on the roster? Who needs running backs? I mean, this West Virginia offense could score 40 while blindfolded, okay? I mean, they're that good. Geno Smith, the best player in America. He's Captain America. You know what? He's the best player in USA. 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 Your pants are on fire, bro. West Virginia is not ready for 101,000 people. All out for Mountaineer blood. The Longhorns are ready. What is that stadium up there seat in West Virginia? 50? 60? This is the Big 12, baby. You're not in the Big Least anymore. This is the color you will see on Saturday night. Mountaineer Field seats 60,000. Gentlemen, you. thank you gentlemen, very much. Gentlemen, gentlemen, make your final arguments. Why will Texas or the other guys win? Because that's what they do, Gardner. And my notes are messed up again. David Ash is the new Colton Coy. Jonathan Gray could be the new Jamal Charles. And guess what? Kenny Vaccaro's going to get his wish. DKR is going to be a beehive on Saturday night. And guess who's going to get stung? Geno Smith. Give me a break. And in West Virginia, you can almost see Russia by there. West Virginia's gonna roll for three distinct reasons, okay? One, Geno Smith, we may have mentioned him once or twice, okay? Number two, they've got quick strike ability. Even if the long run defense actually tackles somebody, whatever, they got that quick strike ability and they can get 40 in a blink of eye. And third, the third reason depart, 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 is, is depart, three, energy, three energy, well, energy, energy. oh yeah, the Department of Energy. No, that's a wrong speech. What's the three? What's the uh, three? Andrew linebackers, kick and game. So, uh, there may be like six that. or seven reasons. No, whatever. On that note, we conclude this first and maybe last debate of the football season. Thank you for joining us and good night. God bless you, America.